Welcome to Florida, a state known for its stunning beaches, unique wetlands, and diverse wildlife. But what happens when foreign species arrive and disrupt the balance of this fragile environment? Today, we're going to explore invasive species that are causing serious problems in Florida, from plants to animals and even insects. These invaders are not just a nuisance. They're wreaking havoc on ecosystems, local wildlife, and even our daily lives. Let's dive in and take a closer look at each of these invaders and how they're changing Florida's landscape. The Cuban tree frog is an invasive species that has taken over many areas in Florida. Introduced from the Caribbean, these large frogs compete with and even prey on native frogs, significantly reducing their populations. Cuban tree frogs are highly adaptable and often invade homes and urban areas, hiding in electrical boxes and clogging plumbing systems. Their skin secretes toxins that deter predators, but can also cause irritation to humans. The Cuban tree frog's rapid spread has made it a serious threat to Florida's native amphibians, and has created challenges for homeowners dealing with their presence. The Nile monitor lizard, native to Africa, has established a breeding population in parts of Florida, particularly in Cape Coral. These large lizards are aggressive predators, feeding on birds, fish, and small mammals, as well as raiding nests for eggs. Nile monitors pose a serious threat to native wildlife, especially endangered species like the burrowing owl. Their secretive nature and ability to thrive in a variety of habitats make controlling their population difficult. As their numbers grow, these lizards are becoming an increasing threat to both Florida's ecosystems and its urban areas. Feral hogs are descendants of domestic pigs brought to the Americas by European settlers, and they've established large populations throughout Florida. These highly destructive animals root through soil in search of food, which disrupts native plant communities and spreads invasive plants. Feral hogs also alter water flow in wetlands and prey on ground-nesting birds and small animals. Their high reproductive rate and adaptability make them difficult to control, and their presence is causing significant damage to both agricultural lands and natural ecosystems. Feral hogs are a persistent environmental challenge in Florida. The lionfish, native to the Indo-Pacific, is an invasive species that has become a major problem in Florida's coastal waters. Likely introduced through the aquarium trade, lionfish have no natural predators in Florida and have spread rapidly across the Atlantic and Gulf of Mexico. These venomous fish prey on a wide variety of reef species, including juvenile fish, disrupting the balance of marine ecosystems. Their population continues to grow despite efforts to encourage people to hunt and eat them. Lionfish are a serious threat to Florida's coral reefs and marine biodiversity. The Asian swamp eel is an invasive fish that has established populations in Florida's freshwater systems. Originally from Southeast Asia, these eels are highly adaptable and can survive in a variety of environments, including ponds, lakes, and swamps. They're opportunistic predators feeding on fish, amphibians, and invertebrates. The Asian swamp eel's ability to breathe air and travel overland allows it to survive in harsh conditions, making it difficult to eradicate once established. Their presence in Florida's freshwater ecosystems threatens native species and disrupts the natural food web. The blue tilapia was introduced to Florida in the 1960s for aquaculture and aquatic plant control, but it has since spread into natural waterways. These fish are aggressive competitors, displacing native species by outcompeting them for food and habitat. Blue tilapia can tolerate a wide range of environmental conditions, including varying levels of oxygen and salinity, allowing them to thrive in Florida's lakes, rivers, and brackish waters. Their ability to form large colonies further disrupts local ecosystems, making them a significant threat to Florida's native fish populations. The red imported fire ant, native to South America, was accidentally introduced to the U.S. in the 1930s and has since spread throughout Florida. These ants are known for their aggressive behavior and painful stings, which can cause allergic reactions in humans and animals. They build large mounds in open areas like lawns and fields, and they often attack anything that disturbs their nests. Red imported fire ants also pose a threat to wildlife, preying on ground-nesting birds and small mammals. Their rapid spread makes them a challenging invasive species to control. Citrus greening, also known as Huanglongbing, HLB, is a bacterial disease that has devastated Florida's citrus industry. It's spread by the Asian citrus psyllid, an invasive insect introduced from Asia. Once a tree is infected, the disease blocks nutrient flow, causing fruit to become misshapen and bitter, eventually leading to the tree's death. There's no known cure for citrus greening, and nearly every citrus grove in Florida has been affected. The disease has caused massive economic losses in Florida's citrus industry, 
and efforts to control the spread of the Asian citrus psyllid continue. These invaders are changing the landscape, damaging ecosystems, and causing economic loss across the state. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and leave a comment below on which species you found the most surprising. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.